Good morning, everybody. It's nice and early. We're gonna go and build this structure, this roof for my grandpa. We're finished that today. We're just waiting on my buddy Seth to get here, and I'm uploading the vlog. And I didn't really show you guys yesterday, but I got something really cool. I'll show you. Check this out. It's a Bowflex. The older Bowflex, I think, but. I got it uh, from Dale, Domino Dale at the factory. And uh, hopefully, start getting some muscle mass with the Bowflex. We got some fan mail, right? Yeah. And one of the fans sent you guys a really cool gift. <laughs> it's a really cool gift. And it's something that I know you guys really, really need. Are you excited? Yeah. yeah. It's in there. Okay. Open it. Bullets! Heck yeah, dude! Colin, read the little the little receipt on there. The paper. Here, this but one. There's no gun! No, it's for the guns you have. Read the top. Hmm. Hey, there's bubble wrap in here. Alex Wool. Kirsten and Colin, may you never run out of bullets when feeding your home with Creepers Alex. <laughs> Found the creeper. Now all we gotta do is destroy it. Okay. Man. Oh yeah. yeah. It only took two bullets to go it. Yeah, I know. <laughs> we got tools, man. I Heck got yeah. lots of tools. This is official. You're gonna be like the foreman. You're gonna be like the guy that looks like he's in charge. I don't want that. <laughs> what is this, a uh, sodium halogen light? What are you growing pot, dude, or something? You growing weed or something, dude? <laughs> <laughs> tomato plants. Oh, tomato plants. Yeah. Tomato, my mistake. Dude, let's do this, man. Heck yeah. I'm ready to build. I had fun yesterday driving nails. We're gonna drive about a couple thousand more. Well, now what? Get that hammer and hit it off her. <laughs> Hurry up, it's hurting. Hurry up, it's hurting. Ow! Ow, oh, my toe. Ouch. You better go get a band-aid. We're getting ready to start heavy and hot on this baby. And by hot, I mean hot. So I'm setting up the GoPro so we can do some time lapse. That's confidence right there. When you set the ladder up on that header, mm-hmm. <laughs> going up the ladder. Hey, you remember how that board broke when I leaned it up against the house? You say that now that I'm up here? Put that down. It's a timeout. Timeout for deliberation. We could cut all this out to pick up more headroom and drop this level down to this level. I think this will be very, very nice for Grandma and Grandpa, when they're all finished with it. Nice little cool enclosed space for them to enjoy the outdoors without being too hot. Have fun, honey. Mm, thanks. I'll do my best. I like your little. Uh... That's my bro pack. <laughs> We're here. We're here. Looks pretty fun. Wait! One, two, three, go! Break time. Everyone got snacks. Colin got Fritos, nachos and cheese. Colin got Skittles. I got nacho too. Soft pretzels. All this yummy pool food. I just want to say <laughs> thank you. You're welcome. Heavy, heavy, heavy. Thank you for what? 
For snacks. For snacks? Yep. I'm bringing you to the pool. You're so sweet. Oh my goodness, that face. You got them. <laughs> Boys decided they're gonna go off the low dive. Ready? Ready, Carson? <laughs> awesome. Okay, swim to the ladder. Go. <laughs> <laughs> Do cannonball! Cannonball! <laughs> the zombie again. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right. Call in. Go! On the ladder! We was told that as long as we're not encroaching on the property lines back then, maybe not now, but back then, as long as we stay within 10 feet of the property lines, we would be all right. That's what we was told. You understand why we have ordinances? I do. Well, maybe I'll sit down here and read some of this, okay? First of all, I ain't gonna fucking do anything. Wrong. Okay, okay, that's fine. You came in all wrong, my friend. You came in hey, all wrong. Whoa, whoa, you, whoa, hey, whoa. We've hey. had nothing but problems here, and yeah. you don't have, you don't tell me nothing. You've had problems here. Yeah, you, yeah, wait, so wait, wait. When? Because every neighbor around here wants to know how you can change a resident, a barn into a residence without ever applying for anything. Them? No. Who? He can't say. I cannot legally That's what say. I thought. I can't legally say. That's what I thought. This has been here since 99. I know it has, because I was a member of the church. I knew when we sold your property. Okay. It's so, funny It's funny but, how our neighbor you, just so happens to be outside when she never is. Yeah. She called. applied to be a resident. And when you it go to sell it. It was back in 99. And when you sell it, it's got to all be turned turn back to the way it was. Let me tell you guys something. The city of Somerset money. has some whacked out officials. We're they not, come into a job site we're not selling calling names, you're saying if we screaming, sell it, we're screaming That's right. cursing. Mike Henry's my name and I'm proud of it, buddy. And I'm going to enforce this to the letter. I, I hope you do. I mean, that'd be just doing your job. That's but you right. could so, be a little more polite about it. That's my point. So when did it change to where you need, instead of a zoning permit, because that's all we've ever been told that we needed is a zoning permit. When did right. that change? It's always been that way. We had, we had a permit for this. We had a permit for that shed. We had a permit for that deck. And we called the guy about the permit for this, and he said you're going to be out of town. Do you know that they didn't have a permit for that? 
this has been ongoing. I'm asking you to produce one. I'm not the one here that's had it. Well, what I'm saying is you're telling them that they absolutely did not have a permit for that and that everybody knows it except these That's people. what I was told, and if I'm wrong, I'll admit to it. So now it's hearsay, not facts. No. I tell you what, let me go see. Car, let me go see driveway up like 10 years I'll ago, and they won't put them down and fix the goddamn thing. Yeah. So basically what's going on is a city official has come into our property hot and heavy. He admitted blatantly in front of us, in front of my camera, that he was pissed off because we didn't, I couldn't provide him a zoning permit, a permit to build what we're building. And in the city of Somerset, it's mandated, it's an ordinance or whatever, that you have to have a permit. And this guy came in on all of us dudes saying he's pissed off, you need to stop what you're doing and yelling at us. I gotta tell you what, that's that's not the way to go about it. That's not the way to go about it. Yeah. That's what's wrong with the city of Somerset is because of people get penalized for fixing up their houses. Thornville is a gorgeous town. Somerset should be a gorgeous town. There's so many, there's so many dilapidated houses like right next door. Stop. But now you see as a resident, you people need to go to council meetings and tell them what they're doing wrong so it can be right. Let me go out here and see if I can get Call me. Uh, Let us know. I just need to step on the dogs and get care of my baby. Old man Rivers is up there on our porch calling his supervisor cohort or something uh, to figure out what's going on with this permit and we'll find out shortly if we can continue or if we have to wait all right we're good thanks for your time Lunch break. Uh, no let your, let your wife know that we'll be in touch i'm sorry that it worked out the way it did but when you don't have all the facts and like i said you know it always got all the good to get the rest of the story <laughs> But Dean, like I said, Dean should have let somebody know that he was going to be proceeding with it, and he failed to let anybody know. And of course, only me, him, and Denny Young, that's it. There's only three of us. And all of it was taken. Yeah. Yeah, basically. That's about it. Okay. All right. Well, thanks good, for your good time. Luck, good luck with your project. Like I said, I apologize for being a horse's ass. All righty. <laughs> well, thanks so much. So the building inspector, whoever this guy was, he's out of here. We ain't stopping. It's onward and upwards. Onward and upwards. She will be erect. I wouldn't be doing that, what you're doing. You want to see what my, my spidey web looks like? Shut up. <laughs> You typical, you typical man with the beard comment. I like it. It's been days, weeks since I've eaten. It's time to go get some food. My mom made some tacos, I guess. You coming in for tacos, dude? I'm coming in for tacos. Yeah, yeah. Taco Saturday. Dude, look at this bomb plate Dallas made. Look at that, dude. Is that like a... Uh, homemade Nacho Supreme, Nacho Bel Grande. You know it, bro. <laughs> Top Chef shit right here. That's pretty. That's pretty solid piece right there, dude. Pretty solid. Can you make mine for me? Can you take this one right here, dude. No, I'm gonna do something better. I'm gonna do something better. I don't know if you can do anything better than me. We'll see about that. <laughs> I'm gonna beat Dallas's dish really easy. We're gonna do it like this. Put in the beef, cheddar, cheddar cheese up in this. Lettuce. Oops. Oh, I see. Tomato. Chipotle sour cream. <laughs> little dolly. Little dilly dally on the tip top. The tippy to the tip to the tip of the tip top. You don't stop. With a taco beef. It's a taco beef. It's going to be a taco feast for me. Ting! What do you think? Looks good. That's going to be. Yummy for my tummy. You're not staying for ice cream. Uh, Seth's got a bounce. And you guys should really thank Seth because through that whole incident, 
I was filming with my camera and the battery died. So he happened to have a camera himself. I have And that's what we're using right now. Seth, thank you so much for your hard work. This dude is truly awesome. I mean, I was kind of climbing like a... Yeah, baby. the last part where he started to get crazy, I knew we should probably break for lunch before somebody got killed. <laughs> yeah. But, uh, thanks, dude. No problem. We you can, can pat you, you can come over here anytime and sit up there and talk to them. Any yeah, tacos? Any tacos? I'll make them for you. Oh, yeah. Cake time! Cake and cupcakes. You gotta know whose birthday it is, right? We still have to. Oh, yeah. Kind of it's Grandpa's birthday. Yeah. yeah Happy birthday! His birthday was Wednesday. His birthday was Wednesday. Yeah, yeah, his birthday was Wednesday. But we're celebrating today. Mm -hmm, yeah. Looks pretty good so far. We got a little while of work left to do, but we probably won't get the uh, actual roof surface on yet because they're using tin and uh, they don't have it yet. So we're just getting the framing finished and I don't know how long we'll be doing it. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Father Tom. Happy birthday to you. Y'all blow them out. Yeah. Blow them out. Come on. 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 We just finished. It's too dark. I can't even. Hey, we had so much fun building today and like almost fighting with a city official. That was awesome. Right? We had fun at the pool. Yeah, you had fun at the pool. Yeah. We had a good day. So you guys had a fun day at the pool? Yeah. It was super awesome. Going off the high dive and stuff? Yeah. Yeah. I'm really proud of you. You're falling asleep, ain't you? <laughs> they are probably exhausted. <laughs> <laughs> Swam their little hearts out today. Yeah. Well, I had a lot of fun sweating my little heart out <laughs> on this roof. And I can't even believe. Like, what do you think about that city official guy rolling up on our property? Crazy, crazy, crazy. I don't even think... I don't, I don't think I caught the best part of it, which was the very initial when he, when I looked over my shoulder and he was standing there and then he asked, who's in charge here? And I was like, I am. And he goes, I want to see your damn paperwork right now. And I'm like, I'm not in charge. <laughs> <laughs> Actually. Actually not in charge. So I don't know if you can tell, but my hair is like, Plastered with oh, don't, sawdust. Don't touch. Just sit still. So basically, when we get home, I'm gonna have to take a shower because I am pretty nasty. And then at that point, it'll probably be midnight. We're gonna end this right now. Right here, right now, while the day is still awesome. Oh, and this battery's flash. Alright, guys. Thanks so much for watching today. We love you. Ronnie loves you. We will see you right back here. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Tomorrow.